One of the most important things to do when setting up your Power Teacher Pro course is ensuring that the final grades are calculated appropriately. To do this, first we will click on Settings, and then Traditional Grade Calculations. Here we'll see a drop-down with the currently selected class automatically expanded. We can see there are reporting terms and the formula type used to calculate final grades. To edit, we'll simply click on the pencil. Here we can select whether we want final grades to be calculated based on standards weighting, using which attribute, mean, medium, mode, highest, specific weights, or specific sums. We could change this to total points or category weighting. We can also add multiple types if we want to, so that the final grade is calculated based on all three of these things. We can change the weight of each type if, for example, we want to put more weight on total points and just use category and standards weighting to a smaller degree. But as a best practice, we recommend simply setting your total points and weighting assignments by assigning them different levels of points when you create the assignments. This checkbox will determine whether or not PowerTeacher Pro should run the overall class grade calculation. There's also a drop low scores tab. This will allow you to drop scores based on the lowest overall score, which we can change to the two lowest, three lowest, and so on scores to drop. We can also drop individual scores by category. If you click on settings and then standards grade calculations, you can edit the way that your standards grades are calculated at the end of the period. We can change this from most recent scores to a mean, median, mode, weighted mean, highest, or no calculation for standards. You can also change how far back the standards scores go in calculating them. And we can calculate higher level standards automatically by using this checkbox and selecting the metric. It is very important to ensure that your final grade calculations are properly set up by communicating with your admins and using this interface to double check that everything is set up correctly. By doing this, you'll avoid a lot of headaches at the end of the year when final grades are finally being reported.